Hello, this is Tiptop here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this monkey guy. Um, it's very, very, very simple. Uh, as you can see, it looks very nice. All it's made out of is a sphere, so don't worry. And yeah, so today we'll be making this. So we'll file new, and we'll go here and um, click on sphere and make the segments to 8. Now, once you've done this, make the object editable by clicking this button or C on your keyboard. And now click the button with the squares. Now you can choose any face of the cube, you, uh, the cube, the sphere you would like. Now click um, on this one and click shift and click on the other one and click, sorry about that, and command or control and click and choose extrude inner now do the same thing but click extrude actually wait, sorry don't click extrude, click on matrix extrude and now just drag out the arms about there now we'll do the same things for the legs, so double click on the legs and click up here and click extrude inner. Now make sure preserve groups is unchecked and click on ex uh, matrix extrude and drag them out and that makes the legs. Now to run this, we'll um, make sure we're on extrude and um, do a loop selection by doing UL. And this icon on your on your um, on your um, mouse should appear. It's got um, four lines around it, uh, four arrows, sorry. And uh, so choose the top, and you, it should select kind of like the cone shape on top, as you can call it. Now go up here and choose extrude and pull it up to make the neck and pull it up to make the head. Now it probably doesn't look like a head yet, but it will do. Now choose UL again and oh yeah and make sure you're on this one. Uh the one with the line. This um the uh the line one. Now click on the line where the neck should be and click on this button here. Oops no not that one that one this one click on that and just click anywhere in the screen, don't click on any of the arrows, just click on the screen and drag it in. That's good. Now click back on this button. And now we can choose... Mm, show me... Yeah, we'll make the eyes, and actually we'll make the feet. Now click on that, click on this one and shift and this one and drag them out to your liking. Now we'll make the eyes, now click on this one and this one and make sure you're on extrude inner and pull them in and go on extrude and pull them out extrude inner extrude and pull them in again now click here and here with control and make sure preserve groups is on the extrude inner Actually, wait, yeah, on the extrude, pull them out. Actually, wait, no, we'll do extrude inner. Extrude inner, pull it in. Extrude, pull it out. Extrude inner, pull it in. About there. Extrude, extrude, and pull it in. About there. Now I'll make the ears. So we'll go click on this one and this one with shift and go on to extrude inner and extrude to your liking and actually we'll make them bigger yeah now click on the hypernerves button drag the sphere as the son of the hypernerves and it should make your character now if it if it's done something wrong well it's not the program that's done something wrong it's probably you now for the tail. Now the tail is easy enough. 
just click on hypernerbs and cl click C on your keyboard so it's editable and click on this button here and highlight where you want the tail to be so I'll highlight about uh, about there yeah that should do and now click on the other little mouse button and drag it onto matrix extrude and make and they go all haywire like so and that is how to make your little character oh yeah sorry click on hypernobes again and drag hypernobes into hypernobes one and that should make it look slick yep so thank you for watching this episode of tip top hero and um, please rate, comment and subscribe for more videos like well either like these or if if you comment and ask me for a video I'll I'll, I'll try it out and do a tutorial on it so um, yeah thank you for watching please rate, comment and subscribe and 